Hello all! I just wanted to say before we get started, um, thank you so much for the support on the last part. I'm so happy you guys enjoyed my, my dub, and um, if you want to stay up to date every time I upload, make sure to subscribe, turn on the notifications. And yeah, now let's get into the Diddly Dank dub! Okay, now that we're all here, I'd like to explain my hypothesis. <laughs> um, can we eat first, Donnie? <sighs> just, just eat while I talk. We don't know if we're on some sort of time limit. We don't even know if our little problem will get worse over time. Simply put, we just don't know enough about the problem to waste time. But we need to eat and rest. How else are we going to take care of Leo if we're too tired? Hmm. I just want my dumb dumb brother back. We all do, Dee. It's not just you. But Mikey's right. We're gonna need all our strength. Leo's gonna be a handful otherwise. <laughs> I need a handful of anything. I'm a big boy! Oh my gosh, he spoke to me! Oh, so cute! Regardless of whether you all are listening, I'm going to explain my current findings. So, here's what we know. Leo is a child now, and somehow that correlates with him helping Mikey. Currently, I've noted that our powers tend to mirror each other's. Rafts are more tangible in a literal sense. While Mikey and Leo's are a bit more difficult to grasp, especially Mikey's. With Mikey's most recent development with portals, it makes sense that Leo would have a new ability that's more similar to Mikey's powers as well. M Master Michelangelo, he's the one that sent me back in time through a portal. <gasps> Do you think? Precisely, CJ! Because Leo cannot remember anyone but Papa, my hypothesis is that Leo is not merely a child. Hmm. Donnie, you're about to lose your place as the funny one. <sighs> not like that! I mean, it's possible he has literally traveled back in time. As. In he's literally Leo when he was five years old. Back to the exciting part. It wasn't por a portal like CJ. It, it was just Leo that changed. It's still just a hypothesis, but if Leo has unlocked a new power, it can really open up some options for us in the future. <gasps> like what? Teaching my older, younger brother to read? <laughs> Not to worry. I'm not sure Leo ever actually learned how to read. I just mean unlocking new mystic- Hey! I can read? I'm the goodest at it! <laughs> that was super cute, but is he gonna be stuck like this forever? Well, if his mind and body are five, then it stands to reason that he cannot access his nympho or his powers. So, until we can figure out how his powers work, then yeah, he's stuck like this. Hmm. Hey Mikey, Raph and I are gonna check out the library. Are you sure you can handle Nardo? Shh, we'll be fine. Babysitting's a cinch. It's hard to run around like that, huh? Hmm. There we go. Is that better? Oh! Okay! Alright, little dude! Ready to have some fun with your bro? 
<laughs> Michael, what's this? Ooh, Leo, what are you doing up there? Don't move! <sighs> Leo, you have to eat something other than honey buns. But at least tell me what you like. Uh, Leo, you win! Please come out! <laughs> I'll give you more honey buns! <sighs> Alright, moment of truth. Leo, I got pizza for lunch. It's pineapple. And it's square cut. Hmm. It's rectangles! Rectangles! Uh, uh, I mean, it looks edible. Why Leo loves square cuts? Alright, boys. Dinner. Dig it. Eh? This doesn't look like pizza. Um. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> uh, is he okay? <sighs> I think he's finally lost it. Eee! Rectangles are my favorite. <sighs> That's nice, Leo. Now go to sleep.